Hi everybody, today's focus, I'm testing force of nature to see how well it removes bacteria in my home. So force of nature is a different kind of cleaning product. It's one that we actually make fresh in our homes. All we have to do is take some water, put it in the electrolyzer, add the concentrated packet of vinegar and salt, and turn on the machine to electrolyze the solution to create sodium hydroxide and hypochlorous acid, which is a disinfectant. I've had a handful of viewers interested in having me test force of nature in my home. We've had requests from Icky Rusin 9868, KAH 2010, Dixie Devil, Elizabeth Garland, Paul 6325, and my sister. Force of Nature has a lot of information on their website about their product. One of their biggest claims is that it's non-toxic and it is an amazing disinfectant. They list many ways in which you can use Force of Nature. They say that it's pet friendly, baby safe, and can be used on food touch surfaces. But how well does it remove bacteria? In order to test how well Force of Nature removes bacteria from my home, what I'm going to do is take some sterile swabs and a petri dish, just like this guy here, and I'm gonna label it A, B, and C. I'm gonna swab several areas around my home and place those samples in the section labeled B for before. Then I'm going to clean the area according to the force of nature's directions, which say to spray, let the area remain wet for 10 minutes, then wipe, swab the area afterwards, and place that in A for after. Sears are control, nothing's gonna go there. I did purchase a force of nature bundle, and it came with these cleaning cloths, so these are the cloths that I'm going to use to wipe my surfaces after the 10 minutes. Let's see how well force of nature removes bacteria from my home.
for some results. The kitchen counter. In the before section, we can see a lot of bacteria there, and we can see different types of bacteria. This is a really nice sampling from the kitchen counter. And in the after section, we have zero bacteria. There is nothing in that after section. So Forest and Nature did an amazing job at removing the bacteria from my kitchen counter. The kitchen sink. Again, we have a great sampling of bacteria in our before section. We get some different types of bacteria, really good sampling there. In the after section, we have absolutely no bacteria there at all. So again, Force of Nature did an amazing job at removing bacteria from my kitchen sink. The kitchen sink drain portion. This area is usually a really difficult place to remove bacteria. I don't always test cleaners on the drain. However, I did for Force of Nature, so let's have a look. The before section, lots of bacteria, which we expect from a kitchen drain. In the after, none. Zero bacteria at all. This is absolutely amazing. So Force of Nature did an amazing job of removing the bacteria from my kitchen sink drain. If you like seeing Petri dish results, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button and give me a thumbs up. The bathroom sink. Before section, we have a great showing of bacteria there. That's a lot of bacteria in my bathroom sink. In the after section, we have nothing. There's no bacteria growing at all in my after section. Once again, Force of Nature does an amazing job at removing bacteria from my bathroom sink. The toilet rim. The before section shows a smearing of bacteria. That's a ton of bacteria on the toilet rim. In the after section, I counted 20 bacterial colonies. There is a significant decrease in bacteria from that smearing to 30. So it's not like those other ones where we went from a lot of bacteria to absolutely none. But this still is an amazing job. I still feel that the force of nature did a great job at removing bacteria from my toilet rim. The toilet bowl. So normally I don't test uh, cleaners on the toilet bowl unless they specifically state that they are toilet bowl cleaners, but I was really curious as how well Force of Nature would work. So let's look at those results. Here we go. The before section, we have a ton of bacteria. That's a lot of bacteria hanging around my toilet bowl, which is to be expected. In the after section, this time I counted 30 bacterial colonies in the after section. This is amazing. This, I, I'm shocked at this result actually. So Force of Nature does an amazing job of removing bacteria from my toilet bowl. Now Force of Nature does have a short shelf life and that's why we have to make it in our homes right before we use it. It lasts about two weeks, which for me was okay because I used a bottle in about a week. For those of you interested in the scent of Force of Nature, it is extremely light chlorine, like swimming pool scent. It does not linger, it is not overpowering. You can smell it a little bit when you're spraying, but it's, it's nothing that lingers or sticks around long at all. If you want to learn more about Force of Nature, I'll put their link in the description below. I think it's a great product, I think it's innovative, and I really like that the real world results that I received in my home match their product claims. If there is a product that you would like me to test out, do me a favor and put it in the comment section. I will do my absolute best to get to it. Or you can mail me something. My mailbox address is also in the description. Just do me a favor and send me an email beforehand so that I know it's from you. I hope you found this video helpful in deciding whether or not you should give Force of Nature a try. Again, I can say that it works really well at removing bacteria from my home. I am going to continue trying it in other areas just as a cleaner, removing grease and dirt also. Overall, I'm super impressed with Force of Nature. Great job, Force of Nature, for giving us a product that really does remove a lot of bacteria in our homes. Take care. Have yourselves a great day.